We hear this all night long, plus fireworks, and our hotel is right here. It's awesome. It's trying to sleep at night. It's good stuff. There was a first road stage. It was a uh, pretty good. The racing here is really different than what most of us are used to back in Belgium. Uh, definitely a lot more chill and easy to move around. Super hot though. It was. Yeah, they see fireworks. Uh, <laughs> as, um, around like a hundred plus at some points today, and yeah, I'm not used to that. <laughs> this music is very entertaining. Um, yeah, it's all right. The heat kind of got to me, so I think with the next few days it'd be good. I feel a lot better to, towards the end of the race, so so it should be good. I think I lost a little bit of time in the GC, but yeah, just some hard stages coming up, so I'm not too worried about that. So, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna go have dinner. Uh, and the Puerto goes with that, I was like, hola. And like three of them said hola, and the one's like, hello. And I was like, whoa, she said hello. So, we're here with Larry Warbass of Team USA with the word of the day. What is it, Larry? Bastard. <laughs> Apparently, I'm not gonna be a good bike racer if I don't become a bastard soon. <laughs> So for the, for the viewers watching, explain where that you're becoming a bastard. Well, I need to start pushing guys around. Well, no, no, you gotta tell them a story. Yeah, so what, what is the story? So well, this you know, guy was riding, came into our little echelon thing, and I just tried to talk to him in Spanish and tell him that was my wheel. With, with a little tap on the shoulder, like, excuse me, sir. And he didn't dig that, nice. so uh, <laughs> then Cole yelled at me for not pushing him off the road, and uh, yeah. so you, that's pretty much it. So now I have to be a bastard. All right. Thank you, Larry. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.